joy. Amen. Today is the day. Amen. The day of joy. Amen. This is how excited I am, guys. There is fish today in the house. Right from Lucy's kitchen. Delicious organic fish. The real, 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 real original fried fish. Join me, guys. And let's get cooking. If this is your first time visiting my channel, I want to welcome you. Thank you for stopping by. And for my return subscribers, thank you so much for your endless support. Join me and let's get cooking. So guys, this fish is called angel fish. I am going to put a link down below so I can show you how I prepared this fish, how I cleaned it and how I made it to, to this level. So guys, before you fry your fish, you want to go ahead and make sure it is thoroughly cleaned and dry. You don't need water when you fry fish. Okay guys, let me whisper to you. Your fish must not be moist. It must be dry. So that's why you see me drying my fish. And guys, yeah, I am using angel fish. You can use any other species of fish of your choice. Okay? Just make sure you dry it properly. Yes, guys. That's how we do it in the kitchen. Okay? Yes. So I will not be talking much in this video, guys. I want you to pay keen attention attention to specific uh, tips and details. Comment down below. Let me know how you how you uh, fry your own fish. How do you prepare your fish? Do you fry it with water or do you dry it like I do, guys? After drying your fish, you have to set that aside. Now you have to prepare your ingredients, guys. For this recipe. I will be using only dry ingredients. I know that most times I will blend my garlic and ginger with a blender, but with this recipe, since I want to fry it to perfection, I don't want anything that is moist in my recipe. Everything will be dry, okay? You can see how dry my fish is. Now, guys, here are my dry spices. I've got onion powder here, guys, cumin powder, okay garlic powder aromat okay fish spice ginger spice okay this is uh, the ground ginger and some paprika for the color guys i'll be using some aromats and also some sea salt okay so now i'm going to marinate my fish guys I am not rushing, okay? After marinating my fish, I will cover it and leave it to sleep in the fridge. If you are in a hurry, you can go ahead, after about 30 or one hour, you can go ahead and fry your fish. But I am not in a hurry. Tomorrow is Sunday. I am going to fry it after church tomorrow, okay? I am just marinating it this night. I will leave it to sleep overnight in the fridge guys this step is very 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 important because you want the spices to marinate in the fish you want so that when you are frying this fish your neighbors will be asking mm, mm, who is cooking who is cooking okay yes and even the taste guys your mouth will thank you the whole family will enjoy that they are eating fish you don't rush when cooking things like this okay yeah. <laughs> thank you so much guys if you have been watching up to this time and you have not subscribed what are you waiting for go ahead and hit the subscribe button okay and while you are at it look next to the subscribe button you will see the notification bell kindly click on that as well so you get notified each time I've, uh, i upload a new video and those who are visiting my channel for the first time oh man i've got lots of recipes my channel is loaded from avocado oil you've got carrot oil you've got peanut butter oil granite oil and what have you guys just browse through my channel you will see lots of recipes for you to 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 to, to enjoy okay so guys, you can see my fish is well marinated and I did add some oil, okay? The oil is going to keep my fish moist while it is marinated. It's not going to dry out. 
Now I am going to cover this and I will keep it in the refrigerator. I will see you guys tomorrow morning. Okay? Stay tuned. Good morning, guys. Today is Sunday morning. And here is our fish. You can see it's got some juices there. Now, in your frying pan, just add a good quantity of oil that you can use to fry your fish, okay? Here, I am using canola oil. On some days, I can use coconut oil. You can use even avocado oil, any oil of your choice, okay? Now, I went in with some aniseed star, some garlic, and some bay leaf just to flavor my oil. Okay, guys? Mmm, the garlic. Woo, my world. You need to just be in my kitchen, guys. This place smells divine. Okay? Now, just go in with your fish. In a pan like this, guys, do not put more than four pieces of fish in it. Yes, if you put more than this, your fish will cook and cook and cook. It will never fry. It will be cooking and absorbing the oil, which is not healthy for you. Okay? Just four pieces of fish at a time. And another secret, guys, you can see how easily my fish is when I flip over. That is because I left it to cook, guys. Never you disturb your fish while it is frying. Always leave your fish to fry to perfection before you attempt turning it. Okay? You can see how easy mine is. It's not because of the species of the fish. It's just because of the technique. Okay, guys? Thank you so much for watching. I am so glad that you found me worthy to share my recipe with you. I am super excited to have you all in my life. Thank you so much. Please do not forget to leave me a beautiful comment, okay? Tell me, how do you make your own fried fish? How do you marinate it? You can even give me an idea of how to do it next time. If this is not appealing to you, I am open for criticisms. I am open for corrections. It is because of corrections that I am what I am today. Because I am open to receive criticisms. That is, that is why I am who I am today. I want to thank you so much, guys, for sticking by me. I appreciate your company. So, guys, you can see my fish is world fried, okay? It smells good, okay? And my husband said it tastes so good as well. Guys, what other validation do I need? I am... <laughs> so, guys, here is it. Our fish is ready. Just go ahead and enjoy that with some chili sauce or whatever sauce that you prefer. Until next time, guys, when I come again your way with another yummy recipe, I want you all to stay healthy, stay safe. Until next time, bye-bye.